Welcome back to another video guys, it's JJ Fish Community and today we're actually going to be in our, the room today So, uh, and today's video is going to be about a filter I got for the 55 gallon tank So let's head straight into this filter video So yeah So yeah, as you can see the tank is not clear at all Um, this is going to practically be a before and after so you guys see tank is not clear and it's gonna do like in practically a review on how this filter is and how it works and everything so yeah so um i'm gonna show you the filter that i got and yeah so let's head straight to that and this is the filter that i have um this is the aquatech ultra quiet power filter for for aquariums 30 to 60 gallons um it has biotech advanced biological filtration it has a complete three-stage filtration, uh, free algae scraper, and my camera focuses. That it just says uses easy change. So yeah, so th this is not a filter that I would, if you guys were like going out. This is not something I would go straight to getting, but this is just a quick because this tank does not like is I need it to be clear because I. Uh, for me, I, personally, I hate looking at not clear tanks. It just annoys the heck out of me. So the first thing, we're going to open the box and show you what's inside the filter, what comes inside the box. It's going to be like a whole review. So yeah, let's get straight to the box. So, so when you open the box, you're going to see your filter. It's going to be looking like this. I like that nice all black color. It looks pretty clean. Uh, and where you can purchase this filter, you can purchase it at Walmart. Um, it's a Walmart filter, but wa I had success with a lot of Walmart filters, so don't think oh just Walmart uh, It's not gonna work good. It's it's worked pretty good for me So I'm gonna try a 55 gallon filter from a tank out how, how it works. So yeah, so let's take the filter out of the box So when you take the filter out of the box, you're gonna have the top um, Two filter pads and then just like I don't know what those are if you can comment down below what the heck those are I don't really know uh, then you're gonna get uh, like everything else so you're gonna get the tubes the propeller that go inside the filter and then the algae scraper which is for free and it comes inside the filter and then the instructions are in there but I don't really need instructions because I've set up many filters so yeah but um, when you if you're doing like a like a uh, getting this filter uh, you can look at the instructions, but personally I don't and don't think that just because it's a Walmart filter Like I said before it doesn't work good. Don't judge like from where it comes Practically by its cover because watch I hope this filter turns out that I hope the tank turns out so clean tomorrow And then whoever's just watching this video will go out and get a filter from Walmart and maybe It's successful for the for them and they don't have to spend extra money on the filter that they think just because more money on a filter doesn't mean it's gonna be better. So, all in all, uh, let's see how this filter works. I'll do a video tomorrow on it. So yeah, let's head. Uh, let's set up this filter real quick. So, bam. So, this is the things that come inside the filter. Like I said, uh, you're gonna have an instruction manual. Uh, we don't really need that. So, trash to me. Uh, you need an audio scraper. I really have a bunch of these, so I really don't need this. So, yeah, that's, again, not needed. Um, Then we're going to get to the port and tubes. So, since I already know how to do this, I'm going to show you guys real quick. So, what you're going to do, this is going to go first into the filter. So, it's going to go like that. And then you're going to push it down, obviously. And then you're going to get this part right here. You're going to put it like that. Put it inside so that um sorry I should have got my tripod oh uh, you're gonna put it inside like that push it in so that it's fit in good then I'm gonna get the longer piece of tube you're gonna put that inside of the other one as well push that in Make sure everything is tightly squeezed because you don't want anything to be out. 
and then the intake right here you're gonna put that right on the top and that's basically how to make a filter bam now you have a full filter thing so yeah that's basically how you make the filter um, they're gonna get these you you want to wash these because this has a bunch of carbon in it That's what makes the tank clear and that's what filters everything so you want to wash this for in cold water For like a couple seconds both of them and then yeah So I'm gonna do that real quick put the filter on top of the tank set everything up and I'll be back uh, It's gonna take a couple seconds for you guys, but it's gonna take a couple minutes for me So see you when I have everything set up. So three two one Woo. So after a long everything, I finally got the two filter pads washed. Uh, everything is set up here. I had an uh, extra like media bag, so that's gonna it's not uh, this can have old bacteria from the old filter, so that I would be fine with doing this. Let me just zoom out a little. Um, so yeah, uh, once you do all this, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to take water from the tank, put it in the filter. And then, yeah, I'm basically show you what that does. So, let me get a cup of water, show you what you have to do, and yeah, so yeah. So, what you're gonna wanna do, get your cup, then you're gonna wanna just put it in the filter until water starts coming out from like the two spillways here. This does so the motor doesn't go off. Uh, air. You never want to run your motor on nothing like no water. So as you can see, it's up to the rim and then you could just add water afterwards. So that's ready to be plugged in. So I'm going to plug it in real quick. Actually, where's the plug? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to plug it in real quick and I'm going to show you guys that. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to plug it in right into here. And then you guys are going to see. Actually, let me turn off this, just so, so I'll, I'll be back. Okay, in three, two, one. So, the water's bringing up from the filter. And, there you go. And then, what you're going to do is when you're going to get your top, right here. And you're going to want to put it on the right way. Not like me, being a dummy. And then, that's basically how your filter is, is gonna look. So then you wanna move, for me, move my light back. And then, now, Fishy's got the low, even though they had the thing for that while I didn't have a filter on this. Hopefully, I'm gonna do a video tomorrow. Why is my thumbnail doing that? I don't know if you guys can see. I'll turn the light on. Yeah, I'm not sure. But hopefully this will be clear by tomorrow. Um hope you guys uh made this video to use uh, because it took me a while to do everything. And this is how your filters are gonna look. And I don't know if you can hear it but like it's not that loud compared to like other filters, so that's pretty good. Um, the flow looks good So so far the product has Has gone to its word. Hopefully by tomorrow. This will be clear and uh, yeah Hopefully you guys enjoy this video um, Many videos are gonna be like this to come uh, So let me turn on this light real quick so To end this video um, So yeah uh, Here's the starfish if you guys want to see so yeah, I said in my last video uh, that I have three 10 gallon tanks open to do whatever with them and one person commented They said to do a salt water So a salt water tank may be on its way. I'm still trying to find a way like maybe here to put the tank not sure uh, I don't know but somewhere in my room. It's gonna look really nice um, I'm gonna see get a stand probably for it But yeah, so if you want to subscribe subscribe to this channel I really appreciate any subscribers and it helps me feed my fish or not help me feed my fish because I'm not getting any money from YouTube yet. But hopefully soon I can get money from YouTube from all the success that I've been getting from you guys. 
and all the love that I've been getting from you guys. Um, and put on your post notifications because I upload pretty like often. So yeah, don't want to miss out on any videos that are coming here because we got the best content here. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, uh, subscribe, put on your post notifications, and hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a great day. Have a great rest of your night. Hopefully this video helped you. If you want to get that filter, you can. Uh, so yeah, I'll do a video update tomorrow. So make sure you watch out for that video tomorrow. So see you guys on the next one. And peace.